Hello everyone, this is Mamta Mount and today we are going to learn and solve exercise questions 1 to 4, exercise 3b, chapter 3, chapter name is Decimals of class 7th of Composite Mathematics textbook. If you have not subscribed to my YouTube channel, then please subscribe to my YouTube channel and hit the bell icon for getting notifications of future videos. And please visit my blog messenger.com for more information regarding the textbook solutions of CBSE, ICSC and the other state board. Let's get started and solve some questions of the chapter decima. Today we will learn and solve exercise questions 1 to 4, exercise 3b, chapter 3. Chapter name is decimals and topic is multiplication of decimal numbers. Let's solve some questions. Now question number 4th bit, multiple choice questions, MCQs. First question is, uh, if 213 multiplied with 16 is 3408, then 1.6 multiplied with 2.13 equals. In 1.6, after the decimal point, there is only 1 digit. After the decimal, that is 6 only. And in 2.13, after the decimal point, there is 2 digits. That is 1 and 3. 2 digits. So, 1 digit plus 2 digits is 3 digits. So, total number of digits after the decimal point is 3. So, we have to place, uh, we have to move the decimal point to the 3 place to the right. 3408. Move the decimal point to the 3 place to the right. 1, 2, 3. 3 place to the right. That is, we have to place decimal point here. So, the answer is 3.408. Option C, that is 3.408 is the correct option. So, 1.6 multiplied is 2.13 equals 3.408. So, option C is the correct option. Now, question number 2 is 1 inch is 2.54 cm. How many centimeters are there in 100 inch? 100 inch. 1 inch is 2.54. So, 100 inch equals 2.54 multiplied with 100 how many centimeter in 2.54 uh, there is two digits after the decimal and uh, so we have to place we have to move and in 100 there are two zeros uh, so we have to move the two move the decimal point to the two places to the right move the decimal point to the two place to the right Zero. So, answer is 254. So, option C, that is 254 is the correct option. If we multiply this with, uh, that is, first convert this 2.54, that is, that is 254 divided by 100, which is the fractional form. Now, multiply with 100. So, answer is 254, so which is correct. So, 254 is the answer. So, option C is the correct option. So, 1 inch is equal to 2.54 centimeter. So, 100 inch uh, is 254 centimeter. Now, question number 5th bit. High, uh, high order thinking skill that is HOTS question. First question is 3 multiplied with 0 0.3 multiplied with 0 0.03 multiplied with 0 0.003 multiply with 3000 equals which option is the correct option so first multiply with that uh, without the uh, without the decimal that is first multiply the whole number that is 3 multiplied with 3 is 9 9 multiplied with 3 is 27 27 multiplied with 3 is uh, 81 81 multiplied with 3 is 243 in 3000 there are three zeros so we have to place three zeros here now uh, total Digits after the decimal point is here 0 0.3 is 1 digits, in 0 0.03 2 digits, in 0 0.03 there are 3 digits after the decimal. And so total number of digits after the decimal point is 6 digits, 6 digits after the decimal point. In 250, 243000 there are 6 digits. So we have to place the decimal point. So, we have to move the decimal point um, to the 6th place to the right. Now, it becomes 1, 2, 
0.4246 decimal point will be here 0 0.4243000 that is 0 0.243 because after the decimal point 0 has no meaning so it will be 0 0.243 0 0.243 so option c is the option d that is 0 0.243 is the correct option so 3 multiplied with 0 0.3 multiplied with 0 0.03 multiplied with 0 0.003 multiply with 3000 equals 0 0.243 so option d is the correct now question number two high order thinking skill question first question 0 0.00 0 0.05 multiplied with 5 minus 0 0.005 multiplied with 5 equals which option is the correct option first multiply this number 0 0.05 multiplied with 5 uh, without decimal first multiply 5 and 5 5 multiplied with 5 is 25. In 0 0.05, there are two digits after the decimal point. So, we have to move the uh, two, move the decimal point to the two place to the right. Here, right, that is 1, 2. So, we have to place decimal point here, two digits after the decimal. So, it will be 0 0.25. 0 0.25 minus, and here 0 0.005 multiplied with 5. Uh, first multiply without uh, without the decimal that is 5 multiplied with 5 is 25 and in 0 0.005 uh, after the decimal point there are three digits and in 25 there is only uh, two digits so we have to place one more zero before the digits two so it will be 0, uh, 0 0.025 now 0 0.25 minus 0 0.025 that is 0 0.250 minus uh, 0 0.025 which is 10 minus 5 is 5 and 4 4 minus 2 is 2 mm, this 2 2 minus 0 is 2 0 0.225 0 0.225 is the correct option so option b that is 0 0.225 is the correct option so 0 0.05 multiplied with 5 minus 0 0.005 multiplied with 5 equals 0 0.225. So option B is the correct option. If you have not subscribed my YouTube channel then please subscribe my YouTube channel. And if you have any doubts, then please write in comment section and I'll reply. Keep learning, keep watching and please subscribe my YouTube channel. Thank you. Thank you.